Hey guys and welcome to Brave Dog Training Online. Have you tried to do right by everybody before? Then this video is for you because we're talking about who you should try to do right by and who you could try to do your best but don't be perfect. I'm Anita, I'm a professional dog trainer I show you how to build a trusting relationship to conquer fear and reactivity and teach your dog life skills to live happily in your day-to-day -day life. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, like and tell me in the comments if this is something that applies to you or you never try to be perfect for anybody. Now have fun! All right, so this is something where we women tend to specialize and focus our attention and all those things. We try to do right by everybody. We try to be everybody's darling. We try to be perfect for everybody in, and in every situation and with everything we do. And this is not happening and there is actually one person you should do right by and you should really put on top of your importance list and that's yourself and no that's not selfish because you can only be considerate and caring and loving to others if you are to yourself first and no you don't have to put everybody else first yes you can have a career yes you can have hobbies and you can choose things that are fun for you even though other people tell you that that's not okay because you have responsibilities yes you do and one of them is taking care of yourself. I know that's hard. I'm still learning that. <laughs> but it's so important. And whenever I feel like I'm taking care of myself, I'm doing things just for me, I am a way better friend I am a way better dog mom, I am a way better family member, I am a way better dog trainer. Because if I try, for example, as a dog trainer to do everything perfect for my clients and give them the goals, serve them on a silver platter, it's overwhelming for them. It really is. because. They have to do their part and if I keep pushing and pushing and pushing to make it perfect it's too much right so always consider what feels right for you and in dog training what feels right for your dog okay and if you want to do something with your dog and you're not quite sure how yet be it hiking together and you want to prepare your dog or be it working on aggression and fear and reactivity issues and you need help with that go to the description book a free call and we see how I can help you I would love to meet you I really love helping my clients with all my heart so why don't you write me in the comments if this is helpful at all for you and what you will do today to take better care of yourself. I would love to read those comments. I will get back to them as much as I can. And I wish you an amazing time with your dog. Until next time. Bye.